What up, guys? It's your boy APT Songs here, back with another music song reaction. We are reacting today to the songs off Taylor Swift's newest album, Midnight's, the 3 a.m. edition. We are in the 3 a.m. tracks right now, and we're going to be reacting to this next song called Would've, Could've, Should've. I like the title already, but let's see if I like the song, all right? So without further ado, here's Taylor Swift, Would've, Could've, Should've. Here we go. Very haunting. If you would have blinked, then I would have looked away at the first glance. If you tasted poison, you could have spit me out at the first chance. If I wasn't painted, it's better on a promising grown man. And if I was a child, it didn't matter if you got to wash your hands. Is she going at John Mayer? Because who was she dating at 19? I believe it was John Mayer, right? I, I'm just I'm just asking because I'm, I'm not fully involved in the history like that, but I think that's who she's talking about. Ghost memories feel like weapons And now that I know I wish you left me wondering Wow, she never gets rid of a grudge at all, does she? Like she's with been with other dudes and is still writing about dudes from her past. If you never touched me, I would have Gone along with the righteous If I never blushed Then they could have Never whispered about this And if you never saved me From boredom I could have gone on as I was But Lord you made me feel Important And then you tried to erase us oh. So interesting In the lyric part of the song um, She's saying would have and could have But she doesn't list a should have Until the chorus I just, as a writer, I'm just curious about why that is. Like, why isn't should have mixed into the, the, the main verse somehow? Oh, 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 you're a crisis of my faith. Would have, could have, should have. If I'd only played it safe, I would have stayed on my knees. And I damn sure never would have danced with the devil. At 19, and the God's honest truth is that the pain. Time? Dang, like you had no good memories? Dang. She's saying give back my girlhood, but she's saying she dated a dude at 19. So uh, were you were you not in womanhood at 19? Like I thought once you get past 18, you're not a woman. So prior to your womanhood, you had your girlhood. He took nothing. <laughs>
interesting like beat that she's doing like it's it sounds like it's supposed to be like a rock beat and it has some kind of rhythm but it's like a I don't know if it's the guitar riff or the drums in the back that make it seem like it's a bit off kilter for me. Uh, it's not a bad thing. Actually, it's one of the more different sounding beats on this album, which is admirable. And I actually do enjoy it. But I'm trying to like go with that and then like how she's putting out her lyrics. And it's like the two are kind of mismatching for me, even though somehow it still blends together. I don't know. It's weird. That was an interesting song. Uh, again, I don't know for sure if it was about John Mayer or not, but if it is, it's just interesting, the thought of like, oh, this guy hurt me and he's so bad. And it's weird hearing that without hearing the other side of things. Cause I know with a lot of these songs, especially ones that like women put out these anthems are like, oh, this guy treated me bad, blah, 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 blah. And we never get like the guy side of it. Cause in the public eye, the guy's just kind of like, hey, it didn't work out, wish her the best, it is what it is. But we, they don't ever go into like, and she did this thing that annoyed me or this thing upset me or she stepped out on me. Like you don't really hear that a lot of time from the guy side of things. So it's one of those songs where like, I can appreciate her putting pen to paper about the pain she was going through, but I don't really know what he did that made her so upset. Beat wise, it was pretty good. Like I said, the rocking sounds in the back were kind of off kilter to me, but I, I liked it. It was almost like it was almost like hearing a beat over here and then just pasting lyrics to a song without necessarily having to have those words go with that beat, but somehow it still worked, even though it was kind of off a bit. I don't know. It's hard to explain. But let me know your guys' thoughts. Did you like the song? Did you like the beat? Leave it down in the comments below. Also, if there's a song or beat you'd like to see me, re or, sorry, if there's a song or video you'd like to see me react to in one of these videos, leave it down there as well. If I haven't seen it or heard it, I'll react to it. Be sure to like this video, subscribe to this channel, and yeah, check out the other videos that I've done in this series of reacting to Taylor Swift's Midnight's, the 3 a.m. edition. I got one more to react to, guys, so we're going to get into that. But for this particular review, I'll catch you guys in the next one. I'm out. Peace. All the girls in the place trying to get in my space, but I only want you, I only want you, want to smile in my face and give themselves a taste, but I only